Good evening. Well, after four frustrating years, the Ashes belong to Australia. Michael Clarke's men reclaimed cricket's oldest and most valuable prize, and they did it in three straight tests. Let's head west now and join Clint Stanaway live. Clint, how are the celebrations going there? Well, Kate, good evening to you. They are in the rooms as we speak with family and uh, friends and don't look like emerging any time soon, really. Nathan Lyon, of course, he's the, the man in charge uh, of belting out the team song. We understand he did so with some gusto. And fair enough, too, because this is an extraordinary triumph. A series win just a few weeks back for the likes of Michael Clark and Darren Lehman, one they could only dream of. Ash's redemption at long last. That's it! After four long years... The most famous trophy in world cricket returns to Australia. A huge party erupting in the dressing room as the realisation of what these players had achieved sunk right in. <laughs> Wives and girlfriends also joined in the wild celebrations. The pain of three successive series losses erased by an emphatic win on home soil and for the skipper, a career highlight that'll take some beating. I think I'll have a headache a little bit later on, but honestly, mate, I couldn't be prouder. Our test heroes almost brought to tears. For us to be able to turn it around like we have, um, you know, certainly you know, the most special feeling I've ever had in my Greek career. This demolition job has been unexpected yet swift, and now so many stories to be told. Like Dave Warner's a bad boy turned wonder boy all in the space of a few months. Then there's Mitchell Johnson, rewind a few months, and he was in the test outer. Now at age 32, his career has been reborn. Uh, the emotions were, were flying. Uh, I was just trying to try and keep him in check and uh, yeah, it's, it's, yeah it's an unbelievable feeling. Also lapping it up, Peter Siddle. It's taken some time but finally here now and yeah to get that last wicket yeah it was obviously there yeah, the dream's finally finally here. Darren Lehman's contribution can't be forgotten either as coach he's molded the Aussies into a fearsome disciplined side with much to prove. What's going through your mind right now? Oh, far out. Right. How many beer, beers I'm going to drink tonight, I think. No, it's, um, oh, look, all seriousness, it's, it's taken a lot of hard work to get to, the, uh, to today. So the Ashes are heading home to Australia, but for these players, there is just so much unfinished business because they want to put England right to the sword and complete a 5-0 series whitewash. And for the away fans, the travel sickness will be hard to cure. Long may it continue. In Perth, Clint Stanaway, Nine News.